Normally, I would just stand here and basically run parts all day long, and the next guy that would come in at night would relieve me, and that, I mean, that'd be about it. Now with this, I can come in, I can load this grid plate up, and I can go set that machine up, I can go set that machine up. I can do basically the job of a few people, really. Well, we load 100 parts up to anything that's gonna run for 10 hours, right? Well, he gets that done, five o'clock, he's out of here. Come in the morning, they're done. And there's other benefits other than just the ability to run parts when people aren't here. The robots improved my job a lot just because at the end of the day you had to be running parts and that was most important was to keep the spindle turning. No one wants to stand there and run 200 of the same parts. They want to program and set the job up and do stuff like that and the robots just made it so that we can all do more of that. Just the morale effect of having a robot sit there, once they get done with all the stuff, they really enjoy it. So that's one side. But what you don't realize is the amount of time you lose throughout the course of a day when the yellow light's on. Where the machine's done, the light's flashing, and the guy's kind of in the middle of doing something else he was trying to accomplish while he's running. Well, you lose that downtime, and the robot's just continuously running. So maybe it takes 15, 20 seconds longer for the robot to run the part. There's no downtime. The yellow light's never flashing. It's always running. And the throughput per day is just amazing. We added a different tray. We have lots of different trays, so we can just utilize the work envelope of the machine as much as possible. Um, we made new fingers for it, different grippers, so we can grab bigger and smaller parts. Didn't really change anything, just tweaked it and got it working perfect for our shop. So here we got one set for grabbing the done part out of the machine, and then another set with the raw stock diameter. Just so, so that way we ensure full contact and we're making, we're getting a good grab of the part every time. And then we took this aluminum plate here and we made our own grid plate so that we can fit a little bit more stock onto the robot. We can use the full reach of the robot and then stack parts on top of that. You know, you get something square and flat enough, the job stacking is awesome, especially in the lathe department right now. Um, the job manager is sweet. You can set up multiple jobs and roll in from one job, finish that job, and roll in right to another job. It's a great opportunity for all of us here to learn new skills and be more productive. And that's really the bottom line, you know, if the shop makes more money, the guys running the machines make more money. 